Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are all having a fantabulous Monday. <laughs> so, my beautiful Pisces, I'm going to put down some holy So good in the neighborhood, Pisces. So, you know what time it is, don't you? Tarot's now in session. Most Honorable Judge T.T. T. Dom presiding. You can all do whatever you want. So, we're going to check in on the energy of that person you're dealing with. Or whatever energy could be potentially approaching you. Like I always say, it could very well be your own energy. Whatever the case is, we will get it. We will hit it. And we will quit it together like we always do, baby. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Show me the energy of the person, my beautiful Pisces is. Sure. Sound off. <laughs> Sound off, one, two, three, sound off. I don't know what is right. Sound off. Sound off. Okay. Oh my god, that looks like the tree man that I seen the other day. I seen a tree man. And he was holding, he was in the trees. I know it sounds crazy. He was in the tree, and in his beard, he held his child inside of his beard. And that looks almost like him. That's funny as crap. Okay. So, Pisces. Mm, 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 mm. I don't know what's going on here. Seems like one of you's busy working on something. And the other one isn't working on something. So I don't know. We'll find out. Okay. Uh, this person is kind of having... Uh, uh, they're... They're trying to get your attention here. Okay. So they could be... I don't know. Maybe they're going outside and screaming your name. Pisces! Pisces! Fernando, Maria, Sarah, Susan, Eric, Lucy, Richard, Steve. Oh my God, I'm hearing all these names. D'Artagnan, D'Artagnan. Somebody here is like, that's the sound off. Somebody here is like, trying to get you to hear them from afar. So somebody's wanting to hear you from afar. So maybe you guys live far apart and maybe they're calling you, okay? Or they feel a distance. And when they feel a distance, they don't know if they should reach out to you. And so instead, they like scream your name. All right, outside, hoping that you're going to hear this, this scream, okay? All right. Strength card, you know, it's all about determination, all that good stuff. It's passion, okay? All right, but it looks like somebody here has kind of got their guard up a little bit here. Mm-mm-mm. So, let's see, what has this person got their guard up about here right now? What do they have their guard up about? What does this person have their guard up about? What do they have their guard up about? What do they have their guard up here with the Nine of Wands? So, somebody here... Mm-hmm. May feel like you just may fire back at them. So, it's like they're keeping quiet about something that they want to say. 
Because if they say this thing, you may just, you just may go off on them, okay? So what is this thing that this person is keeping quiet about? What are they keeping quiet about? Mm -mm -mm. There's some kind of deception here that they're keeping quiet about. What is this deception that they're keeping quiet about? What is this deceptive energy they're keeping quiet about? Hmm. I'm going to pull one more on that, and then I'm going to open up my pie hole. What's this deception with the Queen of Pentacles? Okay. They don't know what it is. They don't know what this deceptive energy is that is going on with you. Okay? But it's like their soul is kind of telling them this, but they just feel like you're deceptive. I don't know how they're, I don't know how to put it other than that. They just feel like somehow you're being deceptive. They're putting up the wall. They're not going to talk about it because they're afraid that you may fire off on them and they don't want you to fire off on them. So intuitively and within this person's soul, and I don't know what the deception is. It could be anything. All right. I don't know. You're going to know better than I am. So maybe you're telling this person you're at work when you're really out, you know, uh, at the bar. Okay. It could be that, or, you know, you're telling them that you're at work when you're really just laying at home and you don't want to talk to anybody. It could be a multitude of deceptive things, but it's like their soul is telling them there is some kind of deception here. And they just need to keep their mouth shut because if they say something, you may just fire off on them. And they don't want an argument, a heated argument to happen. So they're just going to shut up about it. So I don't know, Pisces. You're going to know better than what I'm going to know here. So what is Pisces working on here in this situation? What is this one energy here working on? Just this one energy working on. Okay, one energy is wanting to work on something passionate here. What's this other energy ignoring? I, it could be them that's ignoring. What is this other energy ignoring? Because the other energy is ignoring something. They're ignoring their feelings. Ah, so it's you. You're like, you feel a lot of passion. You're at the point where you're ready to do something here. Possibly show this person how passionate you are. And this other person is ignoring their feelings. How they feel for you. Because they love you. But they're trying to ignore that. Oh my god, Pisces. We got another jack wagon on the table today. It's looking like here. Oh my, Sally Jesus Buttwinkles. Oh my goodness. Okay. So, what is, uh, who do we want to talk to next? Why is this person like, uh, what are they doing here to get Pisces' attention? What are they doing here? Are they waiting for you to hear their call? Yeah. Somebody is like, I don't know if they're talking to you, but it's like, it's like they wish you would just realize that they love you. So they don't want it. They're ignoring their love. They're not saying it. But they wish you would just realize that you love them. Or they love you. Just 
Well, I've been trying to get Pisces' attention. Uh, not doing it related to Pisces' face and the utmost upright energy, but I wish Pisces would just realize that uh, I love Pisces. Oh my god. Well, this is a weird fucking shithole. I just, I, well, I'm going to ignore my feelings and not say them, okay? But, like, you know, when I either reach out to Pisces or I'm screaming to the universe, I wish Pisces would just hear it from the universe. Well, that doesn't work that way, partner. No, that did not work that way, okay? Oh, my God, Pisces. Jesus. <laughs> Get some real Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde's up on this place, don't we? Oh my god, Pisces. Alright. So what's uh what, what's this person determined to do here? What's this determination? What's this determination here? A lot of fire here. What are they determined to do? Well, they're all fired up to get some kind of justice here. So how? what's this justice they want here? They're all fired up to get it. Determined. I'm fired up. Determined. What am I determined to do? Okay. Well, I'm determined to get that fruit. So at the end of the day, this person wants the fruits. Okay. Do they have feelings? Yes. Do they love you? Yes. Have they told you? No. Do you got passion? Yes. Oh my god, boy. Oh boy. What in the bejesus bug wiggles? I don't know about this person. We're going to grab the true emotionals here, and then uh, I'm going to close this with Mother Trucker down. True emotionals. What do we have here? True emotionals. What do we have here? True emotionals. What do we have here? Memories. They look. They looking at your pictures, Pisces. Oh, Pisces. Oh, Pisces. Oh, funeral. Oh, okay. That might have been a funeral. Okay. Right on. Okay. They're losing sleep. They're worried. They're replaying events. They're thinking about you. They're looking at your pictures, Pisces. Pisces, hear my screams. Ah! <laughs> I want to eat your fruit. Oh my goodness, Pisces. I don't know. Like, share, comment, subscribe if you want. Otherwise, <laughs> I can't talk and Tarot's adjourned. <laughs>